Hey, how's it going, guys? Welcome to CryptoCast, your source for all things cryptid-related, unknown, and paranormal. I'm your host, Parker, and welcome back to another Cryptid Reigns, where I'm going to be reading cryptids on a scale of 1 in 10, based on whether I personally believe they exist or not. Um, before we get into it, since a lot of people usually don't stick around towards the end of videos, I'm just going to remind you now, um, be, sure hit that be sure to hit that like button and that subscribe button if you want to keep seeing more content from me. So, today, we are going to be talking about the Billy Ape. And this is one that is really cool, that recently has had a lot of um, popularity. So I figured we could talk about him. So the Billy Ape is described as an abnormally large chimpanzee found in Eastern Africa. Um, they, they're sort of like a mix, they sort of look like a mix between a chimpanzee and a gorilla, um, except these turn gray very early on in life, so they're more grayish color than they are black like gorillas are. Um, they are known to climb trees. They are known to kind of like, instead of like howling at the full moon, it says, they are known to kind of like do like a pant, kind of hoot, like, <laughs> <laughs> like they're kind of panning and hooting in a way. They are also said to leave footprints um, that are relatively different from most modern ape species. Um, the skulls of the billy apes are said to be very different as well. They have like a weird sort of like narrow brow ridged, unlike most apes, which have a wider one. Um, there is a lot of pho um, photographical evidence of these creatures' existence, kind of like this one that we have right here. This is a, a billy ape right here. And recently, um, there has been a billy ape, I believe, that has been... Um, it, they either got DNA of one or they captured one or someone or scientists saw one. So these creatures are out there. So, um, the rating for these guys, I'll say at the end, but you already know what it's going to be, but they're a really, really odd species of ape. Some, some of the locals say that they are even able to withstand the poison from poisonous arrows and whatnot. They are very, very durable and very, very resilient. Um, not very territorial. Um, unlike gorilla, like gorillas, they charge at people. These really don't seem to charge at people. Um, they seem relatively kind of passive um, than most great ape species that we know. But um, still, I don't want to get near one. Those chimpanzees and um, gorillas and apes in general, they are powerful. They can rip, like there was that one, that, that chimp that ripped that lady's face off. Um, they so they definitely have really strong upper body strength, um, but yeah, no. Um, recent signs of these things. Um, I'm giving this one a ten out of ten on the cryptid rating scale, um, and it's a really cool one. I have wanted to talk about these guys for a while. The Billy Ape is, it's it's a really really if it, like I like I said I give this a ten out of ten. I 100% believe this is out there, and I hope. Um, we get more info about these guys soon because it's not every day that you find a surviving grape species that science has missed. So I do think this is really cool. So uh, yeah, the Billy Ape gets a 10 out of 10 on the cryptid rating scale. So again, guys, if you like this video, be sure to hit the like button. You can dislike if you dislike it. I heard if you dislike this video, the Billy Ape will come and smear feces all over your door handles. If you don't want the Billy Ape to smear feces all over your door handles, the only way to warm off is hit that like button. Also, guys, if you're new, consider hitting that subscribe button. Become a member of the Crypto Crew today. You can always unsubscribe later if you don't like my content. It's always free. No harm done. And comment below what other cryptid um, you would like, whatever cryptids you like me to rate in the cryptid ratings video. So, in the cryptids rating, and then in the comment section below, um, I thank you guys so much for coming out today. Um, stay safe out there, and yep, you've been watching CryptoCast. I've been your host, Parker. Stay spooky, and I'll see you guys in the next cryptid ratings. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.